How's it going everyone? It's Max Fisher here. It's Mindfulness Monday guys. It's day 8. Today we're going to work on a little bit of uh, compassion. We're going to work on uh, building our inner humanity. Uh, it's understandable a lot of people they grow up with this idea of who they are, their identity. Uh, and usually it associates to social upbringings, uh, culture, race, ethnicity, religion, uh, ethnicity, uh, country, nations. We have all these, uh, you know, different ways to identify ourselves, whether it's, you know, your political uh, background or agenda or, you know, how big your social following is on um, Facebook or Instagram. We have all these ideas of how popular we are or, um, you know, how smart we are or how this or that or the other thing we always are in comparison to somebody else. And it's all based in our beliefs and ideas that we think we hold true to ourselves and that we hold true to uh, the world around us. And that causes a lot of um, disconnection between the, the race itself, just us as a human species. We can't see eye to eye. We don't... Um, we fight over a lot of indifferences, just uh, just differences in beliefs, and it uh, causes a lot of bloodshed and um, a lot of negative energy and hate in the world. So today, I want to kind of try and uh, make us everybody realize that we're all human. That's it. That's really what it comes down to. I know. Uh, everyone's heard that saying before, no matter what your color of your skin or, um, you know, maybe where you came from or uh, where you grew up or, you know, how much money you make, we're all human. And humans just want to be happy is really what it comes down to. We just, we strive every day to make ourselves in the most pleasant state possible so that we can have like a little glimpse at that, that little bit that's called happiness. But one of the best ways to... Uh, feel true happiness is to empathize with others and connect with others emotionally and uh, it brings a certain amount of fulfillment to you so with all that said uh, today's little mindfulness Monday we're going to do a um, we're, we're going to do a meditation but I want you to focus on the idea that we're all human feel a certain amount of compassion for your fellow human and uh, build an inner humanity inside, not just based on, you know, your country or uh, the people with the same beliefs. We really de develop this idea that we all want to be happy and feel, you know, the empathy of being on this earth with a bunch of other humans that just want the same for themselves. And that'll really help you guys, you know, start seeing things in a different light uh, when you connect with people. And you won't, uh, you won't feel that awkwardness. You, you know there's that connectedness of um, that single emotion of happiness. And it'll start, to, um, it'll start to make it easier to, you know, talk to people, connect with them, find out common, um, commonalities that you might have. And that's, you know... With that, as you develop that, it'll certainly bring a, if we can get everyone to do that, it'll bring a certain amount of peace to the world. So focus on that, focus on the idea we're all trying to be happy, we're all humans. Feel that compassion for each other. And then realize, you know, we all make mistakes. That's going to be the next part, is we all make mistakes, guys. We've all done things because others have hurt us, so we hurt others, hurt people, hurt people. That's part of the saying, you know, hurt people do things because they were hurt to hurt others. So realize that and we make mistakes like you guys got to be understanding of the other. Um, you don't know what their thinking was. You don't even know if they consciously know that they created this, you know, discomfort in your life or somebody else's. They might just have been doing it on autopilot because, um, you know, somebody hurt them in the past in just the same manner. So build your, build your compassion, build your empathy, and build your understanding for others, and um, then learn to let it go, let it, just let it flow. Just 
whatever you've got built up, if it's resentment, jealousy, spite, anger, we're just going to let it go because um, honestly it's not needed. There's no reason for any of that. Uh, there's so much that you can do to take control of your own life that there's no reason to be angry with other people or um, upset or jealous or have, hold a grudge against them. It's really not in the, the nature of happiness to be to be doing those things. So we might as well just um, just work on actually just letting that stuff go and building those neural pathways. And uh, and obviously once we're done with that, we're gonna you know focus on our gratitude because you guys, if you're if you're thankful for everything that you've got, you'll never be missing anything. If you can build this gratitude, this idea that you you been given all that's important and you just need to you know realize that bring uh, see the beauty in the world every day that you go by like we take so much shit for granted um and it's just it, it it wears on your sense of it wears on your sense of fulfillment in life if you can't just take the little things for granted and just be happy and um see see the beauty in everything it really, uh, it really does add a lot of value to your life if you just take those couple moments, uh, whether it's in the morning or at night or whenever you're you're feeling grateful to be doing those things. So, all right, uh, I think it's time for me to stop rambling. We'll get right into the meditation. Come into a, a cross-legged position. Uh, if you got to pull your, um, pull your sweatpants up so you don't have so much tension I actually have to do that otherwise it creates tension it makes it hard to push down right like there and then it puts pressure in your back so just a quick tip quick note to think about um, turn your palms up fingers touching it's funny um, I'll go into this again I've gone into our videos before but there's a certain receptivity that you pick up when you open your palms to the sky and you sit in this cross-legged position and you touch your fingers together. Um, I think in our next Mindfulness Monday, I'll go through the different um, areas of the brain and how it, these all these different fingers connect to the receptors and how you can actually feel the sensations change as you go through the differences in the fingers. Um, but that's another... That's, Besides the point, so index finger and thumb together, hands and palms turned upwards, and some deep breaths in through the nose, out through the mouth. Breathe in deep, diaphragmatic breathing, and exhale. Big deep breaths in, fill up that stomach, and breath out. Breathe in deep, and exhale, slowing our mind and our body down with our breath. Each breath draws in energy. Each exhale releases tension in the body. In through your nose, out through your mouth. Start scanning your body. Feel what it feels like to be made of blood, bone, and muscle, 70% water, organs, heart, and lungs. These are all fundamental constructions of the human body. We are all the same. Sides no different as you move from one to the other. It's only externally we see the difference. 
and our fellow human. It's those external differences that we judge upon and we hold values against. When you just bleed the same exact way I do. your happiness to others and others will spread their happiness to more and the multiplication effect compounds we want to bring humanity together in peace and harmony through love not hate through happiness and bliss. We need to help our fellow man and woman through the tough times. Offer a hand to those who need help because and most assuredly you will need the same help one day. for compassion and understanding. People have gone through experiences in their life which has formulated their actions and thinking. They may be unconscious when they hurt you. They might not even realize the implications of their actions and the effects that it had on you. Don't let them, don't let yourself form a prison sentence of grudge, hate, or jealousy. Come to an understanding that we are who we are, we've done what we've done. But our past doesn't reflect who we will currently become. For the process of change is alive in all of us. Breathe in. Picture somebody you love and feel the sensation of the love fill your heart and warm your body. Now spread that love to a group of people that you love and intensify that warming love glowing in your body. Now spread your love from the group to the whole world. Humans and animals, insects and birds alike. Spread your love for all. We all have a purpose here on this earth. they do this act. They cannot be to blame for their actions. Only you can take charge of how you let them make you feel. It's only in your perception. Try to understand, connect, them along the way so they will hurt less and help humanity more. Learn to judge.
just let go. Let go of the idea that people are untrustworthy, that they'll hurt you, that they'll betray you. Come within control of your own inner self and realize we're all human. We all make mistakes. Just let it go. Breathe in deep. And exhale. Feel a sense of gratitude. around you every day. Simply amazing to be here. To hear the birds chirp. To hear the sun. The amazingness of the clouds, the sky, the grass, the rain, and everything that mankind has built. Be thankful that you've been given such an amazing opportunity to be alive in this lifetime. you have and what you don't have will never bother you. And exhale. Slowly open your eyes. Sit with this feeling. Breathe in deep. of being here in this present in your heightened state of awareness of bliss and satisfaction <laughs> compassion and empathy happiness and joy this is Max Fisher here from a better universe guys Mindfulness Monday. We got to keep it at this level, this vibrancy. There's something special about it. This is what you want to optimize your whole day into. This feeling of ease and joy and peace, of a nice flow. We can ride the wave and not have to try and fight your way through it. I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you're getting on your goals. Hope you're staying after it, guys. It's day eight. Still got plenty of time to make it happen, whatever you're striving for. I'll see you guys on Wednesday. <laughs>